a pipe on a barrel. Whoa. What in the world was that? Welcome back to Skyrim, where we last left off, we just killed a dragon that Yarbal Griffith sent us to investigate. So we killed the dragon, and it turns out we are something called the Dragonborn. Don't know what that is, we're going to find out though soon enough. But let's see what we have to do next. Report back to Yarbal Griff. Alright, so let's go do that. Come on, Sarah. Let's go. Gotta go talk to Jarl Balgriff. I've got your back. Okay, she's still following me. That's good. Sometimes the followers, if you don't talk to them, they can uh, wander off. It's just a little glitch that happens every now and then, for me at least. And if it's too dark, this EMV, let me know in the comments. Because I am looking for new EMBs. And I'm not settled with one EMB yet. But if I do find a better one, then let me know. Let's that five on a barrel. Whoa. What in the world was that? Still pretty dark. I mean, I like how dark it is, but I don't want it where it's like unplayable. Like some games are. It does add a little bit of realism though. Yorland works the Skyforge. How is any smith going to compete with that? I don't care what you're doing. After what happened, you're lucky I don't toss you in jail. Now get lost. We will be back. This is not over. You hear all this talk about You there. War? We're looking for someone in White Rock. We'll pay good money for information. Uh, who are you looking for? A woman. A foreigner in these lands. Redguard, like us. She is likely not using her true name. We will pay for any information regarding her location. We are not welcome here in White Rock. So we will be in Rorikstead if you learn anything. Rorikstead. Why are you looking for it? It's none person? of your concern. All you need to know is that we're paying for information. Sounds a little suspicious. If that suspicious. doesn't interest you, feel free to walk away. We will find her eventually. Okay. You know, we gotta... I want to make it my objective in this series to sleep every night. Why is it? You did it! You killed the dragon. Because when you sleep, you get bonuses. Well, at least XP bonuses. Come on in. Just stoke the fire. Take a seat and get the cold out. Oh, you can hear the rain on the roof. That is awesome. I forgot I had that mod. Sadia, wake up there. Yes, mum. You want a drink? Uh, what's on the menu? Depends. Are you thirsty? Hungry? Both. Did you just see everyone staring at me a second ago? Like, this guy, this guy, and her are all just staring at me while I'm talking to that person. Interesting. It's not like I look any different than anyone else, except I created my character, so I probably do, but not much different. Sweet rolls, wine. 
We'll buy some of that. You know, we're trying to save our money here. All right then. I enjoy this work well enough, but I'm this ready to retire. I've been thinking of selling the into Isolda. Anyway, what do you need? Uh, I need a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room, right this way. And the braggart did swagger okay, that's and nice. his blade as he told of both battles in gold he had made. But then he went quiet. Did Could you slow down a little bit? When he met the shield maiden Matilda, who said. So this is what I'm talking about. Interiors oh, on this AMV are kind of darker than Project AMV. Now I think it's high time that you lie down. Let me know if there's anything else you need. So then came clashing and slashing of steel as the brave last Matilda charged in full of zeal. Okay, let's sleep for. It's ten o'clock now, so we need to sleep for. Let's say we wake up at eight o'clock in the morning. Bright and early. Talk to Jarl. And we'll walk, wake up six in the morning. Sadia dear? Yes, Mom. I'll be needing you to mop the place down extra tonight. Lots of spills. Oh yes, Mom. I'll make sure it gets done. I'm sorry, Sarah. Did you need somewhere to sleep? I'm right behind you. Well, we have a house. Oh well, no, we didn't buy a house. That's right. Take pity, sir, and spare me a few seconds. The security in White Run is terrible. Shameful is what it is. It's a nice little corner here. Okay, let's go talk to you all. Oh, Fred. I'm as much a Nord as the next man, but I'm no fool. I don't live in the past like those gray maids. Well, he's a little... I ain't done nothing. What's the word for it? It's pretty early. Yeah. You walked among us, great fellows. Okay, the sun's starting to rise. Okay, let's go talk to y'all, Balgriff. Should be sitting on his throne, like usual. Good, you're finally here. The Yarl's been waiting for you. you. So what happened at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? Betcha. Uh, the Watchtower is destroyed, but we killed the dragon. I knew I could count on Irileth. But there must be more to it than that. Turns out I might be something called Dragon. Dragonborn? What do you know about the Dragonborn? Nothing. It's just what the men called me. Not just the men. The Greybeards seem to think the same thing. Greybeards? The Greybeards? Masters of the Way of the Voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. What do these Greybeards want with me? The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the Voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thoom or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. I hope so. Grey beards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. I am the Dragonborn. This hasn't Lord. happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tiber Septim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this, what, Dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Prongar, don't be so hard on Avenici. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's uh, just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeard's business, not ours. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something in you, and the Greybeards heard it. If they think you're dragonborn, who are we to argue? You I hope better I am. get up to High Hrothgar immediately. 
There is no refusing the summons of the Greybeards. Sorry, I didn't mean to jump on top of you, y'all, Ball Griff. I envy you, you know. Oh, okay. To climb the 7,000 steps again. I made the pilgrimage once. Did you know that? No. High Hrothgar is a very peaceful place. Very disconnected from the troubles of this world. I wonder that the Greybeards even notice what's going on down here. They haven't seemed to care before. <sighs> no matter. Go to High Hrothgar. Learn what the Greybeards can teach you. You've done a great service for me and my city, Dragonborn. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. Back to business, Proventus. We still have a city to defend. Yes, my lord. May the gods watch over your okay, battles, friend. Um, what can we talk to him about? So I'm Dragonborn. Now, if you don't mind, I've got a city Sorry, to keep. So, Sarah, I'm Dragonborn. Can you believe it? I'm Dragonborn. I'm like the huh? the chosen one, I guess. The one that can save Skyrim, I guess you could call it. Let's go see what it means to be Dragonborn. In the next one. <laughs> I don't know if we can make it there in the, this episode. Okay. It's daytime. So now that we are done talking to y'all, Balgriff, and we gotta go to the dirt of the world. Yeah, speak with the Greybeards. Where is that located? Oh, we have to go to speak to the Greybeards in Iverstead. That's across the mountains. Or we could take that gap. But I don't know. I like the mountain pass better. Uh, we'll do the mountain pass in the next episode. For now, let's go... I don't think we have time for anything else, do we? Do we have time for anything else, Sarah? No? Okay. She says no. I guess I'll end it here. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then leave a like. And as always, if you're new to all my videos and you're enjoying them, then why not, why not subscribe? And I'll see you in the next episode.